today we're going to be doing a demo of one of the new Lush Bubble Brush Reusable Bubble Bars. These came out on the Lush UK site and they do offer three of them in three different colors and scents. This one is the Candy Bubble Brush and it is pink and these things are really large. Like I said, they are reusable, so you're going to be able to get a lot of baths out of them. Um, they're also pretty thick as well. And the candy one smells so incredibly sweet. It has that, if you're familiar with the creamy candy bubble bar, just that sweet candy smell. It is so incredibly sweet and delicious smelling. And basically with these bubble brushes, um, you're able to, from what it seems, you're able to like make back art out of them, like be able to write on top of your your bubbles and stuff like that. So um, if you have a blue and yellow, then you know you can use those to create whatever you want as far as bath art goes. So we're gonna see exactly how that works once um, you know I have my tub filled and everything like that. I don't think that I'll be using the entire thing just because this thing is so incredibly large. But let's go ahead and get our water turned on and see what kind of bubbles we get. So I only used just a little bit of the bubble bar. I didn't use a whole lot. This is like super duper concentrated it seems. Like it's very very highly scented and there's like a ton of color that comes from it. So you really aren't going to need to use much to get your bubbles, to get the, the color and you know to get the, the scent really going in your water. Um, but as far as you know making any kind of back art on top or like coloring the bubbles kind of thing. Um, I just kind of flattened out the bubbles a little bit. I didn't want to mound just so like I had a, a canvas so to speak to work with. I don't quite know exactly how this is going to work. I want to wet this though and then we're just going to see what happens. Oh that's cool. Can you see that? Oh my gosh look. I'm going to try to spell out Exper right here. Let me get my brush a little wet again. Yeah, it seems like you're going to want to wet it every so often just to get the color more prominent. And I'm just like on top of the bubbles very lightly. Like very lightly. But you can see it really is coloring, coloring the, the bubbles. So that's really cool. Like I can imagine kids would find this to be incredibly fun. And like I said, it did come into other colors. So you can mix and match them in your bath water and all of that. And, you know, just create little things on top of of the bubbles. So overall I think this is a pretty neat concept and I love the smell of this. So I am going to jump on in here and enjoy my very highly fragrant bubble bath and play with my wand just a little more and I will be back with what I thought afterwards. Alright, I'm finished with my candy reusable bubble brush bubble bar. The only thing, as always with any kind of bubble bar, is just some leftover bubbles in the tub. As I stated in the beginning of this video, 
the the scent of this and the the color it seems to be very very concentrated so the scent is super duper strong i absolutely love it this smelled so good i smell just like sweet candy it's absolutely delicious smelling and also like we had some really pretty pink bath water as well liked the concept of it i think like i said kids would probably really get a kick out of this product and overall, I was just very, very pleased with it. I'm excited to try the other two and get in there with like all of them and just try to, you know, make some fun little bath art and color my bubbles up a bit. So overall, I really did enjoy this one. I think, you know, you'll be able to get lots of bath, bubble baths out of this. Um, it seems like just a little bit goes quite a long way as far as water scent and bubbles goes. Um, the only thing I did, and we can pan down over here, I laid my, my bubble brush down here on the side of my tub and it kind of made a little bit of a mess, so I'm going to have to wipe that off. So I would say my only suggestion really would be to just have something laying down like a paper towel or something to actually put this on so you're not, um, you know, making a mess on the side of your tub or anything like that. But overall, I did really enjoy these. Um, if you guys, if any of you have tried one before, you'll have to let me know down in the comments uh, what you thought of them. So I hope you guys liked the video. If you're not already subscribed, just hit that button, and I will see you next time.